This is part four of my excerpts from Blue Magic Woman. I'm going to repeat the end of part three. Brigitte says nothing. She stares wide-eyed at Michael for a few moments and then asserts in a lower voice as though she's telling him a secret. When I wear the blue skirt and blouse, every man I meet has an orgasm. They call me the Blue Magic Woman. Oh, Michael replies spiritedly, his anger abating somewhat. I wish you'd have put on the blue outfit then. As he speaks, he notices the huge form of Scar skulking past their table. Again, remember that Scar has threatened Michael earlier. He keeps his eyes fixed on the girl. Brigitte isn't impressed by Michael's sense of humor, though. She seems to think hard for a moment, dropping her eyes so that her face suddenly dims. Brigitte's eyes remind Michael of his favorite color, indigo. As he muses painting her, she moves backward and sits up straight, raising the line of her firm breasts under her green blouse. There is nothing but disdain in the almond-shaped blue eyes of her beautiful creamy white face, and Michael recoils slightly from this barb. Talking with Brigitte, as crazy as she may be, distracts Michael only momentarily from the fear and anxiety that he feels. The room disappears from view, and he's soon spiraling back down into despair. Oh, I wonder what happens if Scar's medicine wears off. His creative mind thrashes unpleasant images about his head, images that are filled with furious color and threatening nuances. Tears startle his eyes, and for one awful minute, he thinks he might start crying. A cup crashing to the floor somewhere behind him brings Michael back. He looks at Brigitte to see if she's watching him, only to notice that she suddenly seems preoccupied herself. She stands up quickly, scraping back her chair. Michael breaks from his mind painting and watches her run from the room without eating any breakfast. At the next table, he observes with a sharp vigilance a massive woman with runic writing tattooed on her arms who appears to have grown rotten with years of psychological disorders. And next to her slumps a woman whose wig of blonde hair has slipped on her head and falls over one eye.